Hello everyone, I hope you're all doing well. So I've pulled into Dollar Tree's parking lot and I am on the search for one of those wall art succulent pieces I regret not purchasing a couple weeks ago at a previous Dollar Tree. So I have some time and thought I would film for you guys. So I hope you guys enjoy the shop with me and we'll go on in. These flip-flops sell so quickly, so if you see some that you like, definitely grab them when you have a chance. They aren't the best quality for long wear. However, for a quick in and out, like if you're going for a pedicure or walking up the beach, they're fine, just not for very long walks or city walks or anything like that. Just gonna peek through the books and see if there's anything here that will catch my eye. This is a great deal as well if you um, love your novels. When the spring things or summer things first arrived, I made a really long video on this aisle. So if you want to take a peek at it, I will link it up above. But I'll go down this kind of quickly to see if there's anything new. Like these ones here, the flashing lights, those are new. I didn't see them last time they were here. So on the opposite um, wall, you'll have all your plates and stuff. And then here's all your garden items. So I'll just take a quick peek down here just to see if there's anything new, but it's still the flamingo print. The, um, the starfish are still here. And then the turtles as well. So if you want a closer video, oh, these baskets are really nice. If they had white like this, has anyone seen white? I love them. But yeah, the turtle print's super cute. And I went to Bath, Bed Bath & Beyond and I did a video there as well um, to compare. And If you want to take a look at that, I'll link it as well for you guys. But they had some similar things to Dollar Tree. Oh wow, I haven't seen these in forever. It's kind of nice to see them back. Oh, these are cute. Oh, they're tin. Very nice. Super cute to put together even as like a little teacher's gift with a gift card. And some maybe pencils or things like that. These little cacti are glass and they're so cute. The little pink flower. And you have your nautical little decor. Oh my goodness, these are absolutely gorgeous. I love anything with blue and white prints. These are like little dessert salad bowl plates. They're so pretty. This is the larger plate. How nice of a set is this? Even if you don't want to use all printed, you can mix a white plate or a I wish the mug had the same blue. It's just a bit darker, it doesn't match. But if you wanted to mix white with this, oh how classic and classy would that look. I love this. Ah. 
I always look for extra small because these make for perfect crafting activities with kids. So these are a little bit too big. Oh, look at the trucker hats and the baseball caps. Also, if you have one of those Cricut machines or silhouette machines, you can decal these and personalize them. Lots of things here to practice on, especially if you're just starting out with a machine like that. I like grabbing them for my son too because then he can just wear them through the summer. And they're great. They wash well. They don't shrink. On this side, look what's all sold out. Remember when I came in and all the mermaid tails were here? Now you only have a few little trinket dishes, so I'm so glad I bought them when I did. Oh, and I bought one of those as well. That one's broken. These are really cute too, like if you have like a bit of a farmhouse theme, those really go nicely in the house. And the little pink ones were super cute. I love the navy blue right now. Anything navy blue. So it matches nicely with those plates too. So many items here that you can put together in a gift basket, especially if you have someone in your life who likes to barbecue or garden. They have a lot of things here right now at this time of year. Oh, these are cute for like a Lego theme party. Super cute. Okay, so these are like the new toy that's really popular with the kids. So I'm going to have to grab a couple, especially for birthday parties or... Oh, look! And they only have like the white ones. No colorful llama. And then one little colored pineapple. Oh, these are new iridescent tissues. So when I did the loop bags for Scarlett's birthday, I used some of the clear ones and it looked so pretty in the bag. It just brought the bag together. Um, I'll show a picture if I can in, in this video.
I've done some really cute stuff with these wood planks um, on the channel. I just did a Mod Podge transfer of an old photo that I had. Um, I link the description up above if you want to take a peek. And I've done some work with these canvases and I absolutely love working with them. They just turn out great and they're durable. I'm just going to go down the craft aisle and see if there's anything new here that stands out to me. Oh wow, these are absolutely amazing. They're really large. The only problem is the writing is already on them. Why would they do that? So last year, and there were a few still lingering, they had an inner little candle holder. Let's see if there's any here. Actually, you know what? They look kind of like this. So they used to swoop in and you can put a little tea light in here.
my ladies are always working super hard at Dollar Tree to keep them neat and tidy. They do such a great job and I absolutely adore chatting with these girls. Oh boy, a new line of nail polish. I love nude colors right now. These are lovely. Has anyone tried them? Oh my goodness, this one has like that iridescent look. Oh, I think I need to buy some. Do you remember the days you used to play marbles and there were like the oilies and those were like the go-tos? Those those ones kind of remind me of that.
I was at Yeska a couple weeks ago and they had a giant, like a set of maybe four or five of these jars for $15. And there's different sizes here. So if you want to combine things for your pantry, you have a nice option on a budget. These ones here are new. They have measurements. I'm so happy to see the Happy Swings back. These are my favorite. I know they're super sweet, so you only can have like one or two, but I love them. They're so, so tasty. I'm just gonna go through the crackers and see if I spot anything new here. There's two actual options here, the roasted garlic. Ooh, Britain crackers, that's always nice. And the Triscuits are a great deal as well if you like that flavor because they have ginger in them. I was looking for the baskets like the red ones at the front so there's this one here and then there's a large large one there so make sure if, depending on what size you need you keep your eyes peeled for that because there are a couple options these are wonderful they were about like a different brand of course at uh, Bed Bath & Beyond they were so expensive so similar and I mean they're going in a drawer no one's looking at them but they're great for organizing things and they're so versatile because you can mix and match them and rearrange them however you need
These luggage tags make for awesome um, attachments. Like you can put your card in here or a room key or an amusement park key of some sort and attach it to a lanyard from the Dollar Tree. They have so many options and then just, you know, keep it on you, attach it to around your neck or even in a bag. But at least you know that your card is not just going to slip away or go missing somewhere. So this is a really practical thing to do with kids. The luau parking theme things are out now. I'm going to say goodbye. Oh, there's some cute little hats here I'll film for you as well. I'm going to say goodbye. I'm going to go to the checkout, but I am going to share my haul with you guys very soon as well. I hope you enjoyed walking through the store with me today, and I do look forward to sharing my haul with you guys very soon. Until next time, everyone, thank you so very much for watching. Bye for now.